Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Arc here on Ragnarok. And today we're gonna be working with the Knights of Crap here. We're gonna be constructing their uh, their round table. These are the Knights of Crap, or wait, no, the Knights of the Crap Table. There we go. <laughs> so I, I was thinking we could use one of these like giant circular platform things here that are like connected to the temple. It's like part of the structure pretty much. Um, they're like leveled out for some reason, and uh, I discovered something. I don't know what else you can snap to this. Do I have any ceilings? I do actually have ceilings in my hop bar. Let's see, can we snap anything else to this? No, what the hell? I don't even understand. Maybe you can snap an actual platform. I don't want to just make one just to check it, but I assume you can. I could snap these giant platform wedges from Platforms Plus, which is the sister mod to S Plus. I could snap them right into this thing. Like, look at this, hang on. Let me, let me come over here and snap one. That one's already lined up, so we're just gonna place one temporarily over here. So, number three. So I can actually snap it in there somewhere. Wait, wait for it. Uh, it's gonna snap to that one, isn't it? Damn it. Okay, wait, hang on. Well, okay, we'll just take my word for it because I, apparently I can't show it. Yeah, it's just not working. <laughs> like, hang on, let me, is there like an angle I could get this at that it maybe would just, okay, well, trust, trust my judgment. It did it earlier. I mean, like I didn't, I didn't, I don't want to pick this up to, to just show it off, but like just trust my judgment. You can snap these giant platform wedges into this thing, and I don't know why. I, maybe there's like a the code to turn this into like to make this look like a tree or something, or maybe it's like foundations or something. I don't know what else you can actually snap into here. Oh look, wait, no, no, that's snapping from my thing here, isn't it? Let me see. Can I snap anything else at all? Okay, well for sure. You can snap these things in. I don't know what else you can, but um, let me know actually. Has anybody built anything on this thing and noticed that before? But uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So we're just gonna snap a bunch of these platform wedges around the side here because we are gonna make a giant kind of temple thing for the Knights of Crap. Um, and we're gonna make a round table. That's why this is here. I've lined up some stuff already because like, goddamn, sometimes it takes so long to, to line the stuff up on video. So um, here we go. This is gonna be the round table. So we're going to use some of these triangle foundations, and I need this, because this has to go away. And we got to place that down there. Sweet. And now I think we're going to go, let's go out with the ceilings, like so. Oh crap, that's not supposed to be like that. Like that, that, and that, and then we got to get some of the triangle ceilings. And this is our round table. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's okay. Do you, what the hell? Did I miss one? Or No, I think, yeah, I just missed that one. I thought I might have placed one in somewhere else. But, uh, yeah, I think it's pretty good. I like it. I'm almost tempted to turn this back into stone in the center. How would that look if it was stone? Um, hmm, not sure. Honestly, not sure about that. But uh, yeah, so we're gonna build this giant temple. I'm thinking we're gonna build up the walls. Um, we're gonna have this round table in the very center here. I'm pretty sure it's lined up in the center. It's, it's kind of difficult to do this without actual like snap points or anything like that, but I'm pretty sure it's lined up in the center. Yeah, it's probably not perfect though. Either way, we're, uh, we're gonna build this temple. We're gonna keep the Knights of Crap in here, of course. I gotta get some chairs and everything in here too. And um, we gotta like build up the walls and everything. So guys, make sure that you hit the like button if you find yourself enjoyed this video. Uh, the Knights of Crap deserve their round table and I thought we might give it to them here today. And it's really nice that we can actually build this in the temple like this. So much better. All right, let's get to building. So first of all, let's go ahead and place down the stone ones instead. See how this is gonna look. Not like that. Yeah, I like it. It adds more color to it. It's nice. All right, so over here, I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna have the railings in the center and we're gonna put walls on the outside, like so. Yeah, this could be good. Um, place these guys down. Eh. Oh, there we go. Um, okay, cool. So I think that's gonna look pretty good once it's all done up. And I'm gonna raise up the walls, of course. Place down these guys as well. And let's get down some of these railings. We don't have to place them all in right now. Just to get a couple in, just for an indicator as to what this is gonna look like. Yeah, I like this. This is gonna look nice. All right, cool. So now let's bring up the walls a little bit. Hmm. 
And I'm thinking we're going to do like sloped bits there and there to kind of arch this up a little bit. Um, that could be nice. Hmm. And then I think we're going to go up from there with large walls. Yeah, that could work. All right, I'm going to fill some of this in then. Okay, so what I was talking about over here, uh, we got to actually come up from this side as well. I completely forgot eh, this button here. We basically just got to place down walls and then we can remove them. Now, one thing that I discovered is that the they have like large walls in S+, plus, which count for like four walls, but they don't have these little kind of beam things on the inside here, which I like. I, I actually kind of like those. So we're not going to be using the large walls. We're just going to have to make singles, which is, the, which is fine. Like, I mean, they cost the exact same amount. Um, just the other ones are a little bit more convenient because you only have to place one thing as opposed to four things. So let's place these down now as well. And let's see, that one goes on that side. This one goes on this side. And I actually brought over some roofs because I'm not sure whether or not I'll stick them on the outside or the inside. Can I stick that out there and like flip it over, I wonder? Hmm, I wonder if there would be a way of tricking the game into flipping it the other way. Because those tiles would look a lot better on the top. I think I know a way that I can do that actually. So let's, I could probably do that right here. Let me do it over the side instead. Um, okay, so I gotta come up by a couple walls. So where it has to be on that height and it has to be going that way. So on this side. Okay, so yeah, I think I know how to do it. If we go like this and if we go, is that at the right spot? I don't think it is. No, that's actually a railing. I thought we had the uh, roof. Oh, damn it. Let me pick that back up. Uh, yeah. Hang on. Let me, let me just place one here just for s some scaffolding, basically. Okay, if I place that there, I can get one on the outside easily. There we go. Sweet. So now that will actually work out, right? I think it will. I can remove that. Yeah, that's going to work out perfectly. Sweet. So now we just do this. Um, we got to place in more walls. Do this. And then we got to remove these walls. And then we got to place down this, this bit. Damn, why did that place up there? How did that place up there? Hang on. Let me see if I can get a wall up on top. I could do one below. That's not lined up now. Great. What the hell happened? Game, please. Why? Uh, hmm. Maybe this is interfering. So maybe what I can do is I can. Eh. There we go. I can bring that out by another one. Then I'll remove this one. Oh, this is like a massive workaround just to get one little detail, but I think it's definitely worth it. Um, so then I go like this. And then I can go uh, like so. Sweet. And then I can bring. Oh no, I need that up there, don't I? Now that's um, that's not lined up again. What the hell? Ah. Okay. Well, anyway, if I was to bring this ceiling back in, it would be in line and it would be facing the correct way. So yeah, I'm gonna do all this. I'm gonna set up each side with that uh, kind of like design, and um, then we'll be back. Okay, so as you can see, we've got all the roofs in now, and it looks really good actually. And I've also extended down some walls there to make it look more natural. And uh, I gotta say, over this side especially, it looks really nice. It almost, like, okay, you probably could say, yeah, I could raise up the entrances, but I think it looks really good because it almost looks like it's um, kind of taken over by the desert slightly. You know, this used to be a big temple, but obviously the desert came in, like, blue sands in, and it just kind of stuck, you know? And it's uh, it's looking really good. I like it. I like the way that I didn't really change the height of anything and it all just kind of sinks in here a little bit. So there's like small entrances, but yeah, I don't know. I like it. <laughs> anyway, so the next step, I think I want to get some pillars in. I want to get them like directly between the two here and I know a trick for that. So what I got to do is I got to place down a wall there and then I got to place down a ceiling here and here. And then from there I can, let me, can I hop up on top? From there, I got to go like this. Okay. 
So what I did there was I placed down the two ceilings and then what I did, I pressed G and that gives me corner snaps and I snapped it directly into the center except on this side. So then from here, what we could do is, I don't think I can remove this yet. I have to have that at a ground point. So to be honest, actually showing this over here would be a lot easier. Um, yeah, over this side would be easier. So I'll do it again. Uh, that's not right. Give me that back. So we want them snapped directly onto this because those two walls are at an angle and that just doesn't suit. Uh, oh wow, I actually got up there. I didn't think I would. All right, so let's hit G, get it right in the center. Sweet. So if I was to remove any of this, that would break. No matter what, an S plus uh, pillars still have to obey laws of gravity. And uh, get that last one in there. Sweet. So now I can remove those and I can extend this pillar up. And the reason I'm putting that in is because the, uh, the platform here, we have to use wood. There is no adobe variant although I'm really I'm really think that they that they actually should make like an Adobe variant of the platform uh, the guy who makes s plus you should do that that would be really good um, so yeah as you can see that stays right there over here it would just it would take me a while I have to get like pillars all the way down to the bottom there and that's gonna take a couple minutes so yeah I just want to show this off really quick it's a pretty simple trick when you're using these platforms and uh, it actually adds a lot of detail just to have that there because it comes directly off of the center beam and it's pretty much the same shade. Looks good. Anyway, um, yeah, Temple of Crap or whatever we're calling it, the crap table, um, it's looking pretty good. I like it so far. Really, really nice. I do also have chairs here. Where are they? Slot zero? Cool. Uh, which way do you place chairs? Now, I think there's like there's like 13 in the Knights of the Round Table, right? So we're going to place... We're not going to have 13 raptors, but we're going to place... Uh, 13 chairs, so let's, let's do them like this on the uh, long foundations. They don't have to be perfect as well because chairs would be pulled out. And I obviously know raptors cannot sit down on chairs yet. Uh, Jurassic World 2 is not out, but I'm just going to assume in that movie that they are going to be able to uh, sit down on chairs. It would make more sense. <laughs> oh my god. Eh. There we go. By the way, actually, I'm really excited about that movie. I don't know if I've talked about that before, but, like, I'm seriously excited, and I really hope the ARC devs pull something when that comes out, because there's going to be a lot of hype around dinosaurs, and people are going to want to play dinosaur games after watching that movie, so the ARC devs, you, you gotta you gotta get something going. This looks really good. This really does. Where am I going to stick the last chair? Maybe, like, let's place it here. No, let's... Mm, Let's place it like here. We'll like move that one there slightly. Oh, okay. I didn't mean to sit down. <laughs> uh, pickup chair. I will place that here. So yeah, it's 13 chairs. Man, that's awesome. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we got a little bit more work to do. I want to raise the walls a little bit more, and then I think we're going to put on the sloped roof after that. And, um... Then we gotta, I don't know if I'm gonna like make actual pens in here for the raptors or if I'm just gonna keep them in here. Not exactly sure yet, but we also gotta do some cleanup, like taking up all that crap there as well. Um, and I'm not, I'm not sure if we wanna have like some sort of ramp coming up here because you do have to kind of jump. Hmm. A lot of decisions need to be made basically. So yeah, I'm gonna keep working on this and I'll catch you guys in a little bit. This is really shaping up here. It looks fantastic. I've also, after um, the last bit, I added two more two more walls into the center there, and then on this side right there, um, let me try to point at it. Make sure you grab the my scope. So yeah, right here. Oh, <laughs> I have to reload. Right here, we have what is called a double doorway, which is part of S plus. It's essentially just a doorway, except it's double wide, and uh, it leaves you with this little bit on the side here, which looks nice. So uh, in the center here between the pillars, I mean, can I, I might as well remove one of those. Let me just grab that. So you can see the two sides are left into the center there. Uh, this one obviously going for that side, this one obviously going for that side. I could add doors in there, but I don't want to. What I want to do is just leave them completely open. So yeah, let's add in this thing here. Sweet. And uh, now I think the next step is adding in the sloped roof. That is not the right height. <laughs> It snapped down. God damn it. All right, let me grab. Where's my climbing pick? Where's my climbing pick? Did I not have one? Oh, there it is. What the hell? Why could I not see that? Oh, crap. I freaking took this off my hopper. 
Alrighty. Let's climb up here. We gotta take this off, but actually this probably helps out because we might be able to get the right height on this one using the current one that we have. Why? <laughs> Alright, please. Oh, I had it. There, that's correct. Sweet. Alright, let us go ahead and grab these. And... Gone, and then we gotta grab this one as well. Is there a way I can keep myself up here? Probably not. Probably just gonna have to turn around and, like, climb back up. Oh, I don't have to fall that far because I landed on the little door frame. Sweet. Alright, so we have it up over this side. Let's climb up the wall. Alright, sweet. So we're up. What the hell? Why did I fall? <laughs> what? I was like, up. <laughs> that was odd. Alright. Yeah. Let's do that. Climb right up to the top. This is the easiest way. If you just get one down, you can just place the rest from the top here and you don't have to worry about the snap points. And there is the roof. Let me see. How does this look? Ooh, I like it. Hmm. I do feel like those little squares open like that need something. Maybe I will add in the doors. We'll see. We will see. So yeah, the room is, uh, it's nice. It's definitely nice. We definitely gotta do something about that. I think they're way too open. Um, yeah, I like it. I do. Hmm, I do feel like it needs something, but I just don't know what it is. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, I, I can't place it, but I, I feel like it needs something. I almost feel like it needs a pillar in the very center that goes up. Is that even possible? Could I get one there? Hmm. How would I snap one into the very center there? I don't think that would work. I'd have to like come off like weird angles because you can't snap one onto the points of these triangles here of the triangle foundations. Yeah, that would be difficult. Totally would be. Hmm. Yeah, no, I don't think that would actually happen. That would be very, very difficult to do. Damn, hmm, maybe I can figure something else out. But yeah, I, I like this so far and I've made a decision. We're not gonna add any sort of ramp or anything here because I feel like it would definitely just take away from this kind of stone platform here uh, in the center. I think if we added ramps, it definitely would just mess that up slightly. And also getting them all at the right angle and everything so it lines up, it would just be a pain. So um, I think we're just gonna leave that and you know we, we're gonna have to jump up every time. It's gonna be fine though. Um, so yeah, this, this room is awesome. Crafters, what do you think? Get to your table. <laughs> Just like line them up around the table or something. Oh man. Actually, what does it look like from the outside? We never even saw. Yeah, it looks nice. I like the way it sinks down so far like that. That's really nice. I didn't want to make a very tall tower. I just kind of wanted to make like a, almost like a temple type thing. So I can't make anything like that. I can't do those angles, but um, I think I did a pretty good job either way. How's it look from like out here? Yeah, that looks nice. I wonder if you could see it from the main base. Let me run back over and check. So we're not too far. So yeah, um, like I, I kind of just decided to do this here by myself here today because um, currently I'm in the process of prepping videos because I'm not going to be here this weekend. I'm actually going to Canada from Friday. What day is this even coming out on? I don't even know. My schedule has like, I'm just, I know how many videos I need to get done. I just don't know when they're coming out. So it might already, I might have already passed, but uh, on Friday I am heading to Canada and I'm back on Tuesday very early in the morning. So yeah, just kind of prepping videos and stuff. Um, that's why I didn't wait around for the guys because uh, yeah, time zones exist. Let me see. Oh yeah, that looks good. Oh, shut up, Siri. God damn it, stop. That looks good. I like that. Let me um go ahead and grab mace here. Or window even is what we called it. Yeah, that looks really nice. I like that actually. It fits in so well. Let me uh let me see, can we 
Go down here. Get like a different angle on it. Hopefully there's no capros. We can't get over that, can we? Ooh. Yeah, that's really nice. I like that. Okay. I want to take a look from the bridge. By the way, eventually, if you guys haven't caught on, um, we're, we're eventually going to come through here and actually revamp this whole bridge. We're going to make it, like, functional to the point where you can actually bring creatures across here. Uh, we're basically just going to fix the bridge and add our own touch to it as well. And I'm really excited for this. This is one of the projects that I'm super, super excited for because, I don't know, this bridge, it's it's really nice. Like, I, I love the bottom of it, like, the little arches and everything. I've always really liked it ever since um, they first added it, like, two or three months ago. Man. And by the way, this, uh, this freaking crafter tower temple thing, it looks amazing. It really does. And it fits in so well. What do you guys think? Um, I'm really liking it. All right, so we're probably just gonna leave the crafters in there. Just gotta make sure that they're actually on neutral because if something gets in there, it will just kill the, all the crafters and that would just be bad. So we don't want that. Uh, let's get back in there then and put them onto neutral. And then we can kind of just leave them in there because that's their little temple. And I can clean all this up after. So you guys go into neutral. Sweet, and also, by the way, the view. Oh no, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> well, anyway, as you can see for a second there, the view is pretty nice. It really is. It's quite nice. Let's get back down to the base. Now I'm bouncing off of everything. Can we get over this? I don't think we can. I think we have to go through the water here. Hopefully not get cap road. But yeah, it's uh, it's awesome. I love it. Okay, cool. So anyway, guys, that's going to be it for today. I know this video probably turned out to be a little bit shorter than the rest, but uh, that is all I have time for for this one. So um, if you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you guys want to see more like this, you can go ahead and, subs bleh, 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 and subscribe as well. <laughs> Words. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next one.